Video 808, let's go. So in the fractal bucket function section within our main fractal fill function, within the flood fill algorithm loop, our infinite loop here, we're gonna loop through every single index of the source buffer. And we're gonna use this bucket get to pull out a current tile and that current tiles position is gonna be loaded into buck got. Then we're going to loop through every single neighbor in this EE4 grow loop. So we're gonna loop through here, top, right, bottom, and left via these enumerations, zero to three inclusive. We're going to convert that enumeration to a relative offset, nox and noise. So this will be zero, one, or negative one um, for these nox and noise values to create a directional vector to the correct edge. And then we're gonna alias buck got to got, just to shorten things. And we're going to pack a whole bunch of parameters into the try grow function here. So right here, we're just we're uh, taking everything from the got function, throwing it in here. This is the address of the current tile that we want to see the neighbors of. We're going to be bound to the current hotel. The flood fill does not go out of the current hotel. And then we want to figure out uh, where we're trying to look for a neighbor. Above us, to the right, bottom, or below by using a directional vector here that's going to have a length of one uh, Nox and Noi. This points to the adjacent tile we want to see that we can spread to or not. Then this is the actual flood fill value, and now we're going to use the try grow function right here with the try grow inputs and the try grow outputs called outgrow. Now if we actually get some outputs in here, we want to offload those outputs into the destination buffer. And then we do that for all four tiles, and then we grab the next tile in the current generation. Then once we're done with that, right, we have to uh, exit if uh, we weren't able to spread. And if we were able to sw spread, we need to buffer swap. And then once we do our buffer swap, we actually have to erase the destination buffer so that we can do one more iteration of the algorithm, of our flood fill algorithm. If you want a longer explanation, you can go to Ninja Playlist 8. You are on Kanji Playlist 8. Source code is here, ways of getting a hold of me. My name is Kanji Coder. I'm making a game engine from complete scratch. It's called Atomic Ivy MMO. It's a fully destructible fractal geometry side scroller pocket Bomberman style game with gold. GoldenEye style proximity mines. Like and subscribe and follow.